Hey, this is Chris from Florida Music, and we're looking at a new piece of software called Immersive U Warp Software. And here I'm actually uh, going to try and warp this uh, unusual uh, projection onto this uh, curved screen to correct all the distortions that will happen when you do things like that. And you can grab the corners and move them around like this. I need to move the bottom to fit the screen here. You just drag the green areas. You can actually make more um, of the control points. You just add them to uh, wherever you need to do them and then warp the screen. Now obviously I need to correct all these squares to make sure that all the squares are very uh, uniform in shape. And then we know that the image that we project onto here will be correct. And in the middle here, you can see it's warped because of the uh, I'm projecting onto a really large curved surface here, and I need to make sure that all these squares are uniform. Now, obviously, with things like this, you can um, use multiple uh, projectors and then bl edge blend to try and get the format. This is an unusual format, extremely wide, extremely kind of thin. But in a multimedia theater like this one is, you obviously need to create that kind of immersive display. Great for gamers as well if you're going to do uh, immersive gameplay and things like that. It's a fabulous thing. Now, you can put on a kind of... Uh, a screenshot of whatever you're going to do just to see the final before you actually show the film and I can see there's a couple of errors I need to go correct here like there's one on the railing here I need to pull down so I can just kind of correct that and maybe the top left hand corner needs a push but you know there's, there's different things you can adjust and you can just about do everything like you know gamma correction and stuff like that in the blends uh, let's just try the movie and uh, we'll just run that and see what happens here be free but why sit all in one place when you can have the whole world So you can see that that really works quite well. So um, there's not much to do here now except from just show the film for real. And, and really that, that was just a 1080 film that we cropped to make it that super wide aspect that we've got here to kind of create that immersive kind of in-depth. Obviously it's not what we're going to be showing at the time. It's a multimedia thing that we do normally. But if, if you're doing for games, um, we've tried it through a Wii. It's out, it feels great if you're doing uh, one of the kind of football games or something like that where you've got a lot of people uh, running at one point. It looks amazing to wrap around. We're, we've tried it on spherical uh, type shapes and uh, even into the corners. And the program has a lot of things like keystone correction and stuff like that to really kind of get the uh, tight images you need. We're running this on a media PC that we make and um, it runs really well. We're running the program, the uh, players and everything else all in one PC. So uh, it really can uh, do a very good job on just a single. And there's very little hit on the actual performance. There's very little frame delay here at all if any um, so uh, even on the high res pictures as you just saw so um, if you're looking for something that uh, really kind of does the job for um, immersive kind of display and or something like that this definitely f uh, fits the bill anyway this is chris again from florida music and uh, thanks for watching